morning and welcome to my channel. If you are new to the channel, my name is Gemma and I'm losing weight following a calorie controlled diet. Today is the 18th of September. It is Sunday and we're just out for a carvery. I've already had some breakfast, so I'll show you the calories, show you everything that I have for my calories. So this is breakfast this morning. I've got two slices of oatmeal toast with a bit of clover light on, some ketchup and a fried egg in fry light. It's 257 calories. Lovely Stephen this morning, all fresh. Didn't get, feel fresh. <laughs> didn't get too drunk. <laughs> We are just back from Toby Carvery and I thought, stuff it, just have what you want. So I worked out calories at about 1,090 calories, but you know what, it was delicious. But it doesn't leave me any calories, so I need to earn some calories. So me and Steve are going to go for a long walk. Uh, Kayla's gone to Marie's in the garden. They're watching, what are they watching? Mask Mass dancer. Mass dancer. Kayla, uh, Alex's playing on his computer so yeah we're gonna go and have a stomp burn some calories and earn something for some tea tonight probably just have cereals after that big thing i mean i might not even want anything but we'll see so i'm gonna set off now i'll let you know how many steps i do at the moment i'm on 3544 so hopefully i'll get us over over the 10,000 mark So we're just back in for the walk. It was two hours and 30 minutes, um, just under 14,000 steps. So I've done 17,000 so far today. Burnt just under 900 calories. Very sweaty, very hot. Everything's aching, especially from wearing heels last night. It's not helped. Um, so I'm just going to pick Alex's girlfriend up. And I've got um, a Morrison's delivery coming at seven, which I'll film, put in the vlog. But yeah, it is 10 to 5 now. I'm definitely not hungry. So I'm just going to have some water after I've picked Bonnie up and just chill out till that delivery comes. And then I've ordered some like uh, protein crackers and like some, um, what's it called, Primula. So I may have that and some fruit, I don't know. But we got Granny Smith's from Alda and they were minging. They were awful kids didn't like them steve didn't like them and i definitely didn't like them so we'll not be getting through it again from alda um they are supposed to be opening a little soon close to us so i'm hoping that they open that soon i'm going to go to kayla shall me so i earned quite a lot of calories on my walk and i've just done kids some like freezer bits and it's made me really hungry and really want like stodge so i'm doing myself an aldi um bassa uh, lemon and herb tempura basa, 200 odd calories each. I've thrown an handful of Aldi skin on fries into the oven and I've got a small tin of mushy peas. So not the most nutritious, but the shopping's coming tonight and then hopefully it'll be a lot healthier from tomorrow. But I'm looking forward to a bit of dodge. Sunday dinner were delicious, so... And I think after a night out, that's what you want. And if I can stick to calories, I mean, we really didn't want to go for a walk today, but we've done it, we've pushed ourselves, and we've gone for a really long one. I said to Steve on, on way back, I said, like, can you can you imagine us, like, a couple of years ago, going on a walk like that? And we wouldn't have ever done it. We wouldn't have ever done it. So we've definitely made some good changes. But Steve's just done himself some pasta with tuna, sweet corn, and he's just mixed through some like garlic olive oil through it um, I've just had a, a mouthful and it is, it is really nice very high up calories but he, it's it is nutritional goals because it was all wheat pasta and stuff so obviously he's looking at food slightly different than I do um, but I am going to try and improve um, after his weekend away and this week actually I'm going to try and improve like look for whole wheats and whole grains and um, 
try and cut down a bit on white breads and flour and stuff like that so we'll see how that goes but I think I need to start focusing a little bit more about what I'm putting in my body rather than just the calories so anyway I'll show you this when it's done so this is tea tonight for 475 calories I'll pop the break well I'll pop the screen scroll at the end and you can see the breakdown of everything I've weighed everything separately so the Morrisons has been delivered and it was £60 and this is mainly just things for us lunches so and snacks so I got myself some sweet popcorn. I thought it's better than chocolate and biscuits. So I'm going to try that as a snack. Uh, some salmon, some cod fillets. The popcorn calorie wise, 97 calories per serving. I'm not sure what a serving is. Um, 20 grams. 97 calories for 20 grams. Some chestnut mushrooms, blueberries. Broccoli, trim beans, got some pink ladies, some of these Rolo yogurts for kids. I might have one as well, 136 calories, just some toiletries, got some linguine and some uh, whole wheat spaghetti. They weren't an all wheat linguine option. Um, but I'm just I'm just reading it and they both say they're made by with same things, but I don't know. I don't know how wheat works. Durham wheat semolina. Durham whole wheat semolina. Right, okay. Carrots. Some cooked chicken for kids pack lunches. 12 calories for a slice. Some wraps for Kaylee's pack lunches. These are 191 calories each. Some creme fraiche because I'm thinking of mine have... I do myself some linguine with the creme fraiche and maybe add some green beans and um, some salmon or something like that or some crispy kale. Loving crispy kale at the minute. It is delicious. And I never thought I'd say that because I'm not a spinach fan and when spinach goes all soggy and horrible, oh no, it's not for me. But this, five minutes in active fry, well not even that, three minutes and it's all crispy and gorgeous. Just put a bit of olive oil on, salt and pepper, one of my friends actually has it as a snack. They just like have it like you would a, a bowl of popcorn. They'd have a bowl of kale, but I've not got to that point yet. <laughs> so maybe, maybe sometime in the future. Sweet potatoes. Now, Steve's having these uh, to replace white potatoes. So he's going to try a jacket potato with sweet potato tomorrow. I might have a mouthful, see what I think. Uh, got some iFiber Jacob's crackers there, 35 calories each. Some Granny Smiths roping, these are nicer than the ones we got from um, Aldi. Just say this reduced fat and fresh. We've been getting full fat, so I'm hoping it's as nice. Well, it's not going to be, but we're going to try it. But a 30 gram portion is 52 calories. Um, some chicken, some, I'm going to try this Primula cheese and chives. Obviously, cheese is all new to me. I've never been a cheese lover, but. I'm going to try different things. For 25 grams of this, it's 57 calories, but I thought that'd be nice on the iFiber crackers. Eggs, really high in protein, so got plenty of them because Steve's been going through loads. I've uh, got milk, pop, got some more tuna. So just use the last two tins. 100 grams drained, 106 calories. Steve's got this beef jerky because uh, it's really high in protein. Calories, 64 calories for the bag. Got some cucumber for Kaylee's pack lunches and there's some tomatoes there as well. Does this come to £60? Pop it away and then I'm going to get a snack to finish the day. So this is what I'm having to finish my day. I'm having a Fox's chocolate chip cookie for 112 I bought just a package, you know, like two layers of biscuits. Um, and I've just put them in for, for me and kids for snacks. And then I've got a fibre one bar. I don't think I've had this cookies and cream one before. But this is 85 calories. I'm actually finishing under calories, surprisingly, um, because of the calories that I've burnt. But obviously, I have eaten quite a lot of my exercise calories. So I just need to be on ball this week with us going away next weekend because I really do want to see another pound loss on the scales. It'd be fabulous to, to know I'm going away this weekend, um, weighing 12.9 and feeling good. So... I'm going to try my best this week. I'm going for a walk tomorrow morning with my mum before the Queen's funeral. 
So we're going to get some fresh air nice and early. We don't plan on going out for the rest of the day. We are going to watch a bit of the funeral, um, obviously pay our respects. Um, and then we'll, we'll just chill out in, in house, I think, tomorrow and hopefully have some nice meals. We've got the Hello Fresh butternut squash and serrano ham linguine, which we're going to be having for tea. Um, and then I'm on a course tomorrow evening for two and a half hours. So I'm going to go and eat this, relax, and I will catch up with you tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching this vlog. If you've enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and drop a comment below. If you've not already subscribed, it would be fantastic if you could. So I hope you've all had a lovely weekend and I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Bye.